Hey guys, you want to be a part of this rescue by just sitting in front of your screen? Click on the membership. Everybody's been asking on how to donate. This is the best way, guys. By becoming a member, we'll be posting videos every week with within questions and answers as well. And all the money will be going straight to the animal. Thanks, guys. See you soon. Okay guys, so this was the guy that um, we got from the shelter. Someone's left him here and he's completely paralyzed. We started to see a little bit of movement, just a little bit of movement. So we've got him on the on the drips as well. Um, he's eating a little bit of food. His digestive system is working fine, okay? His tail's working. Uh, see? Legs are the ears are, whole facial area is all working, okay? We're not gonna put him to sleep. We're definitely not putting this guy to sleep because we know we can get him back. We've done it before to different dogs. Roughly two weeks, we'll get this back guy back on his feet. This poor guy is infested. His uh, genital area is completely infested with with worms, which is terrible. This guy here was laying down in that position, okay, and when we've come in here. It's changed position, so what does this tell us? This tells us that there is movement and the, the therapy is working fine. It's raining, it's uh, kind of wet in here at the moment. I just wanted to show you guys progress. We're gonna move him back into position, okay? And today we're gonna actually take him um, to the vet, to the city. We've already got a vet that's monitoring everything and, 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 and uh, doing all the treatment. But we decided to take him to the vet today just to get scans done and just to have a look at um, if there's anything spinal in your discs that have slipped or anything. So guys, we've got a heater in here. Um, we had to put the heater on in here because it gets very, 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 very cold. Ice cold in here. So, 
we've got a heater, we've got ventilation, so there's air coming in, air coming out. This guy here is in a critical state. He's actually been shot, guys. He's got, as you can see, um, I'll be showing the, the, the x-ray soon. As you can see, he's got, he's got a pellet somewhere around here, okay? And um, what would have happened is someone would have just point blank, maybe just went snap bang, shot him straight in the spine. And that's why this guy is like this. Look, slowly, slowly, he's lifting his leg up. See that? See that? See that? That means there's progress, okay? That's, that's progress. That's when we're winning. Because we remember what he was like when we first got him. He was completely jelly, like he couldn't do anything. You know what I mean? So now we're just, uh, we're working on him. We took him to the vets yesterday. We got scans done. And um, now we're going to do treatment. Push back. Go, bro. Double antibiotics now. We're getting done. Uh, B12 vitamin alması gerekiyor bir de. Okay. Bu B12 vitamini bir de steroid alıyor. Right? Steroids, vitamin B, vitamin B is neurologic. You know, it uh, helps with uh, the brain, the receptors, the neurons. Steroids is good as well for situations like this. And that's what we're applying right now. Give him a little bit of a treatment as well. This gets done daily, two, three times a day. So yesterday we got all of the uh, medication, everything we need. And um, we took this guy to the city. Now it's all about uh, road to recovery. So, intermuscular is the steroids and antibiotics blow the skin on it or the antibiotic. So he's got two different types of antibiotics, guys. This guy is going to be a champion once it's um, We're um, giving him physiotherapy because if we don't do this, then the muscles will start to wear away and there'll be no muscles left. So when he does go to walk, he's not going to have the strength. So at the moment, we're giving him that feel. You know, you do this to, to patients that are, um, that also have ALS. So like, as you can see, like, the muscles are, are going slowly, slowly. So, uh, we're doing this. So it's like a shock, like, it's like he's running, you know? Pressing down on his paws as well. So it feels like he's actually going for a jog. Obviously, it's not the same, but it's better than nothing, you know? Look at his eyes. Look at his face. <laughs> this is, uh, he's all wet. It's because he pees himself. So we're gonna have to clean him. It actually stinks really, really, really bad. You gotta see the faces on the cameraman right now. They're all wearing masks.